It all begins in the middle with Phillips. Back into the team in the last couple of weeks. They've got a clean tap. And Paris and Merrick combining already. And Jones flinging at the ball. Perkins underneath. McGrath gets it forward. Hooker's on his own in front of goal. And you ask the question. And starts the afternoon with a decisive goal. And Essendon starting in fine fashion. Larky in that contest, so they've got some really strong defensive faith in him at the moment. Merritt again as Essendon edging them out around the contest primarily so far. Oh! Such a good kick. Zaharakis sends it forward, Snelling. He had hooker left. He goes more centrally this time, and Cox just kept on coming. It was the sub. He's back in the team this week, and he kicks it hard at goal, and it just sneaks in. Again, it's a low approach on the kick, on the bounce to a Ruckman. I'm sure that was in the plans. Stalling feeding it through to McGrath. And across to Langford was clever play. And he'll go back. Disposals and a goal last week. It's been a fine start by the Bombers. It's been reflected on the scoreboard right now. Oh, the no synchronicity at all between the Kangaroos defenders. Jamont spoiled his teammate. Waterman gets it out. High ball forward. Hooker couldn't get to it that time. Well done, Mackay. Jones from the pocket. Lights it up again. Thank you, Dell. Manager gets involved in that chain of handballs. Simkin ran headlong into Guelphie. That was the best he could manage in the end. Merritt in other positions. Zaha Rakas has been prominent. Parrish plays his part. Waterman's got a thumping kick. And everyone knows it. Back in the team the scoreboard it's a low scrappy ball inside and Merritt gave it to Snelling he was able to keep it moving to Perkins and then to Hind again through the middle they are lining up Heppel Zaharakis on the fly took his time and nailed another one the bombers in full flight you know chopping of the arms but Goldstein they overpowered Hooker, but Snelling was perfectly placed to kick another Essendon goal. Gather it up for the Kangaroos and get it back on their turn. Simpkin plays it short. He's still one on one and again. The Bombers edging out their more inexperienced opponents. They're doing a great job, Essendon, of forcing North Melbourne wide. Harris kicks to Hooker. Vice like. Trots in to kick from 50. Bombers fans think it's good, and they are so right. Should be able to get set up ahead. That's a great kick, and Waterman takes the mark. It's like they're really happy to take you wide. Let, let's take them wide so they're really set up defensively, and then either corridor or the down line opens up. And those extra yards on the Waterman kick, and put right into play, and he takes the mark. Essendon already lead by 39 points. Peter Wright. Peter Wright, he's at his best. He lands another big blow. Lazaro makes that charge towards goal. He's fleet-footed. Redmond runs with him. Lazaro was challenged. And Essendon win again. So it's the patient build from Essendon this time. Rather than the run and handball. It's all by foot. Merritt to Parrish. And Hine, he's got forward again. And delivers it to Jones. A big part of what is a very exciting future. And the present isn't bad either for the Bombers. They've discovered so much. The Kangaroos on the way out. But again, Essendon defenders have the answers. Francis has the share. Kicks to half forward. Langford's had a, a solid game so far. Merritt with a kick into the 50. And again, just the right amount of power. Now Perkins. Runs around, enhances his opportunity of kicking a goal to a very high degree. And the party just keeps on going. Now Davies Uniac does get the go-ahead. Goldstein didn't rush, but unfortunately, from the North point of view, his kick went straight to Heppel. Lined up across the middle of the ground, Hind from McGrath, and then into the leading lanes, and it's Phillips who pops up. He's filling a role for Essendon right now, and he starts the second half in fine style. The Bombers 
with the first of the third. And it's a really congested inside 50 that they can't generate anything from. So that's where you want the Kangaroos. Bring the ball inside and get it to the open side. Weapon as the Bombers go out on the way out through McDonald's and Woody initially. Now 50. Cox. Yeah. And now 50. Uh -uh. Don't need you. Can do it myself. Can do it just like that. Land another ball. Kick another goal. That's two for Nick Cox. It's one on one ahead, which will suit the forwards just fine. Right look likely. Zebulo comes up with the footy. Another one on one battle. Oh, that is high from Young. A little bit of panic. Play on. Play on. And then another little pop kick from Merritt to McDonald Tip and Woody. And he's converted there, so he does kick his first goal. Young curls the kick away. Keep our eye on top goals. Then keep our fingers crossed. It's like a right ankle. Parrish with the setup. Kick towards the front of the square again. Mackay, right. Langford. Yep. Phillips and Langford are there as well. And Langford takes it. Both hands up. Drags down the mark. Phillips goes back to the square. Jones leads one way. And sneaking away from all other comers was Parrish. He's got Hine wanting it in the pocket. He had to play on, he won't mind that. Curl it off the left. <laughs> Great finish. Tapped it down to Taylor. Getting plenty of time around the ball. You don't do that to Anthony McDonald, Tip and Woody. Snelling's handball, meantime, and play goes on. Redmond to Mary. He turned around, there was no one there at all. Had no mates, I'm afraid, on that occasion, but he's going to get the ball anyway. Once again, that touch kick. He's just handling it brilliantly. Right, can he do what he did earlier in the game? Has he still got the energy? He's still got the leg. It's just so right. Yeah, only a couple of points in yeah. the end. Still time for more. Full tilt. Langford gave it plenty to the line. And Waterman, he's got through. Stewart faces his chances. Then full stride coming out of defence. Gets around Lazaro. If you don't mind, James Stewart. He got awfully excited. And that's taken it over the line by Wright. Hey, the charge at him. But not before he kicks another goal. Peter Wright's got three. Redmond lagged the kick short for McGrath. Parrish. Time was running, but he was going more direct to Snelling, to McGrath. They're sweeping through again, and they want to share the love around. And Harry Jones. Crisp kick, straight kick, and the Bombers have got 20 goals on the board. Walker's there for him, or Lazaro. He chose Lazaro, probably wishes he didn't now, because McDonald Tip and Woody is going to lead to a dangerous place. Good work from Turner again. He gobbled him up. Oh, too low. Been pinpoint this afternoon, but we'll take 2-2. Two -two. And another goal for the Bombers. He's got it now. And sweeps the hand pass, so it's all go from here. Zaharakis. Peter Wright threatening again. Another test mark inside the forward 50. What's going on there? Look at some blood. Skips into 40, sends it on its way, and he's got a triple. Now, Zerha, trying to fend off Langford, failed, but he got the hand pass away. Thomas cops it from behind. And he's gone. Of course, they scored 143 earlier this year in the big win over the Saints. But it's still a huge total. It'll be a big roar for the Bombers. And it's been a blast. A 72-point win. And there really is something special being created.